What's going on, YouTube? Did you miss me? It's your guy, Mr. DCYLP. And I want to talk about vinyl today. I want to talk about vinyl for your brand. All right? You see, I have my mask up. I only have my mask up because it's freaking cold outside, okay? It's like freaking 16 degrees out here. All right? But well, we're going to get into this vinyl talk, all right? Right after my intro. So check this out. The question is, can you use vinyl to start a brand? Well, of course. If that's what you want to do, if that's what you have access to, if you got access to vinyl, and you feel like you want to start a brand using vinyl, go ahead and do that. Would I start a brand using vinyl? The hell no. Hell no. And um, that's because I'm a vinyl hater. Okay, I can admit that. I hate vinyl. All right, we gotta look at it like this too. Let's say, let's say you starting out, right? You got this, you got this design that, you know, you created. And um, you're gonna be, you're gonna be um, using a vinyl application to produce this particular design, okay? Now let's say it's like three to five colors in that particular, uh, vinyl design all right now let's say on the low end let's say you got about 10 orders let's say you gotta let's say you gotta make 10 t-shirts okay with three to five colors all right per uh for that design now that's three to five uh different color vinyls you have to uh cut weed out lay down and impress on you know these t-shirts man i don't have that type of time i don't know about y'all but i don't got that type of time man i don't got the type of time to be dealing with no damn vinyl doing all that weeding you know how much you know how long that's gonna take just to do those 10 t-shirts now imagine you now imagine you double up imagine you got now you got a 20 order uh uh, a, a 20 a, a, a 20 t-shirt order or a 50 t-shirt order and you ain't because you you in love with this design and you started it off with vinyl now you got to do 20 to 50 t-shirts using vinyl listen man just think about that all the time you're putting into that all the all the uh the pain and aggravation if you mess something up if you don't weed the vinyl uh properly you miss something forget something now you're tearing up shirts, all right? You're wasting material. Now that could happen with transfers as well, but I'd rather have that with transfers than to have, you know, than to have a major mistake on some vinyl, okay? Um, that's just me, all right? I would rather, uh, starting off, I would rather start off with classes, so transfers or, or, um, or anything else besides freaking vinyl, all right? So that's my take on if you should start a brand off with uh, vinyl designs, and that's just me being a hater. I'm a vinyl hater, and I'm gonna say no, all right? So this is your guy, Mr. DC Wild P. Before I end this, make sure y'all hit that thumbs up. Make sure you hit that bell notification so I know y'all rock with me, all right? I don't want y'all to miss no information, man. I don't got all the answers all the time. But I got a lot. Alright, so till next time. Peace. Let's get it. The message is always in the cloth, the colors, the designs, the fit. Basically, pay attention, stay alert, and remember, choose your own path.